I am audience. I remind myself, calm this restlessness. I am audience. An early arrival, observe in silence. And I study the movements of the woman, barehandedly building a trombone before me. A brass skeleton pulled from a case of felt. Metallic mouthpiece sliding into curved frame. Her right hand releasing the valve as if breath were water, as if there were remembered notes. Rippling outward in a river of sound. A trumpet player covers his mouth, laughs at a joke, looks to see if anyone is watching. A percussionist stretches her fingers gently along the skin of the tabla, generating a gentle hum. And I turn my attention to the figure of a man whose left hand is twisting a neck into tune. Twanging strings in his shape, the fingers on his other, plucking a pick along taut steel lines. Prime meridians running parallel over a carved out shape, whispering frequencies across the guitar. The note, if ever lost, has been found. A tenor saxophonist, mouths a reed, wanders, wood, not yet resonating, a quiet expectation. A flautist runs a feather through the body, removing traces in a before performance ritual. And I witness the woman bent over the bass drum, her foot kicking down on the one. She's fiddling with action on the mechanical contraption, the pedal where her foot will propel the band into forward motion. Then she's done, focusing now, fixing, adjusting, first ride cymbals, then the hi-hat, and then snare drum whose wire mesh bottom echoes in the nearly empty hall like ball bearings cut loose in a tin can town. A sound man, like Snake Charmer, wrestling wires and cords connected into mics. A pair of soundboard technicians calling the muse with levers, knobs, and widgets. Along comes a man spinning a thin baton between his fingers, mesmerizing, wondering, waiting for something to drop. But he doesn't ever stop, so lost in the papers before him, the scratched up music score spilling over sides of an angled stand. His lips mouthing stories of the acts yet to come. He too soon will be an audience of one threading through the tapestry of each musician in each moment where he becomes arachne, stitching a poem to which all here will be bound. I am audience. <laughs>